welcome to a new episode of Prue Talks. On today's show, we are joined by husband and wife, Nick Tay and Jesse Tan. We actually spoke to Nick earlier this month about his role as a family man, but today we're honored to be joined by Jesse, his wife as well. And they're going to be talking a little bit to us about their parenthood journey, as well as the importance of forward planning when it comes to your family. So Nick and Jesse, thank you so much for being here today. Hi. If you could share a little bit um, with us about your family, how long have you been married for? How many children do you have? Uh, we've been married for uh, two years plus and uh, we just had a baby boy uh, last year, which is five months plus now. And I can imagine that being a parent is super tough. I'm sure you guys will agree with me. But I think it's also an equally rewarding experience. So for you, what would be some of the joys of um, having a child other than witnessing um, the birth of your child? I would say uh, when you're stressed, I mean, after a whole day of working, after you're stressed and tired from work, when you reach home, you see your baby boy with a smile, everything is worth it. Yeah. And also, the look on your wife's face. When she, when there's nothing. Fine. There's nothing like that. And I think Jesse, we understood from Nick's interview that um, you had some complications uh, during your pregnancy as well, some struggles, as your son was in breech position at about 31 weeks. Could you share a little bit about that experience with us? Actually, all this while we were out for uh, natural birth. Then, and when we uh, go to the doctor on week. 31 for a normal scan and we just discovered the baby which is still in the bridge position so in the end uh, we just uh, opt for caesarean because it's just for the safety for the both the mother and the child so in the end uh, everything goes well I'm glad you're okay and everything went well in the end. Thank you so much for um, sharing that. But I think it also just shows us that we kind of need to be prepared for these unexpected situations or scenarios. Mm -hmm. So would you agree then that having a prenatal um, insurance plan in place is absolutely necessary in these type of situations? Uh, I think it would be uh, very good to be planning ahead. So uh, I would say uh, a prenatal insurance it will be very important for the coverage for the mother and the child. Yeah, and so postnatal. Postnatal is also very important. Yeah, and I think in the whole process of choosing your insurance plans, if you could share a little bit about um, how you guys decided on it, what you went through, um, who was actually responsible for looking for the insurance plans, and how did you eventually come to discovering and choosing Prue My Child Plus? Was there anything in particular that stood out for you? I'm the one who survey for the uh, prenatal insurance. So uh, we've been surveying it for a few companies, but in the end, uh, we choose uh, Pull My Child because uh, it's ha it has the best coverage for the mother and the child. Yeah, I'd like to stay I have so. and, 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 and what was important for you then while looking through insurance plans? Was there anything in particular you were looking out for um, in terms of for Jesse and the child as well? Yeah, uh, first you got to see your budget, and you got to see your coverage, and you can see the track record of the insurance provider. And um, I think also in terms of, you know, comprehensiveness, um, it's something that Pru My Child Plus has as well. So I think for those at home watching, Pru My Child Plus covers child development disorders up to the age of seven. It also covers emergency C-sections before 36 weeks, as well as 27 congenital conditions and all structural congenital conditions as well up to the age of seven. So if you'd like to find out more, you can always head over to our website that is prudential.com.my. And I think Nick and Jesse, for our last question, just to wrap up this um, session, what advice do you have for expecting parents when it comes to family planning? I would advise that uh, you plan ahead and you must have, a, it's very important to have a prenatal and postnatal insurance for the uh, coverage for the mother and the child. Yeah, and always listen to your wife. That's a good point. I, I cannot disagree there. Um, thank you so much, guys. I think it also really highlights the point about, you know, pre-planning for any unexpected situations as well, though we don't want to think about it or imagine it could happen. Um, but it's always 
better for um, safe mind, right? And I think other than that, we'd like to thank both of you guys for joining us today, Nick thank and Jesse. You. Thank you thank so you. much thank for you. sharing your story and experience with Prue My Child Plus. For those at home, that is all we have for today's episode. Thank you so much for tuning in. We will see you on our next episode of Prue Talks. Until then, you can talk to our Prudential Wealth Planners to start building a wholesome protection for you and your family. Thank you.